Hey guys, Keel Lancer here. Once another Keel Lancer game. Don't forget the bell button, subscribe button, and get the notification to my channel. Alright guys, we got some more gaming news here. And uh, we're back at Game Ran again. And uh, this article is done by uh, Jasmine uh, Henry, uh, February 26, 2020. Alright, now Facebook acquires Sly Cooper 4 Studio. Facebook now owns uh, Sonorous uh, Games. Um, the Sly Cooper uh, Thieves in Time developer making it like making it unlikely that the fans will see Sly Cooper 5 soon. Wow. Facebook announces that uh, it is now owners now the owners of uh, Sonorous uh, Games. Sonorous Games is the developer that created Sly Cooper Thieves in Time and fans may be disappointed to hear the news as it means that the team will be unable to develop Sly Cooper 5. Look, we haven't heard from Sly Cooper in years, so... I, don't, I wasn't expecting anything from this, and you know, it is what it is. Uh, in a, a post uh, on the official Octopus uh, site, Facebook confirmed that Sanus was at Sansua uh, Games will be joining will be joining to the company to help uh, pursue future uh, uh, a future of rich, immersive, and original VR game content. Many PlayStation fans uh, will uh, uh, will known uh, Sonorous uh, Games as uh, Sly Cooper uh, developer, but it had it. It has also released successful VR games such as uh, Arts of uh, Wrath and Marvel uh, Powers uh, United VR. Uh, I think those games are just riding off the hype wall. The Marvel games riding off the hype wall for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Sonora's uh, Games uh, is the second VR game developer developer that Facebook has purchased in the in a, uh, the last few uh, months. Facebook also bought a uh, Beat Saber developer Beat Games in November 2019. Beat Games. Uh, New release will not be exclusive on Oculus uh, VR headset. Uh, uh, and while Facebook did not uh, confirm exclusives exclusivity for uh, Gensua, uh, Sensua uh, games, uh, new games, uh, it did say that Sensua uh, has uh, exciting plans for the uh, future VR titles, and uh, we hope to bring uh, those experiences as many people uh, to many people as possible. Facebook uh, um, uh, moved to. Uh, by uh, VR developers and part of the larger plans to grow Oculus sales. Oculus headsets uh, have uh, been selling well, but as Valve plans to release Half-Life uh, Alex, Alexi, and there is a rumor of Left 4 Dead uh, VR game. So Facebook knows that keeping the hits, uh, the hits as successful uh, will not be easy. Buying developers which can develop making great VR games for Oculus uh, could uh, potentially help the company make millions, millions of more dollars in the headset sales. However, Sly Cooper fans may be surprised and upset by this announcement. In December 2019, Matt uh, Kramer, uh, uh, the leader, uh, leader, the lead designer of Sly Cooper: Thieves in Time, confirms that the uh, development team loves the character of Sly Cooper. Some uh, had hoped uh, Sensua Games would uh, start developing Sly Cooper 5 for PS5, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen sony could uh, potentially get another developer to develop sly cooper 5 though uh in uh last month uh, there was a rumor that a new sly cooper game was going to be announced the game was rumored to be ps4 which seems unlikely as ps5 is releasing in the holiday 2020 but the game could be uh a new and old console okay so pretty much guys uh i i haven't I haven't known that I, I didn't know that uh, Facebook was buying up game companies and stuff like that. And I just recently found out that um, uh, what is it uh, uh, that Sony, I guess, kind of, well, I guess, owns Sly Cooper. I didn't know that. I always thought that this was another like uh, game company that made it, but made it exclusively for Sony. Um, I'm not really a big Sly Cooper fan. Um, the last the last thing I really heard about Sly Cooper was the Sly Cooper movie that never was released. And I ain't gonna lie, it looked interesting. I was like, okay, I'm gonna take a look at this movie. And then not after not too long after that, Ratchet and Clank um a movie was talked about, like probably about a year like a few years later after that. And I was pretty excited for that too. And then um hearing about this news right here that this company's uh, being basically being bought out by uh Facebook is just uh, astonishing to me, you know, Facebook buying game companies, this is kind of weird, um, as for Sly Cooper fans, uh, I definitely uh, feel your pain, it was because, hey, I'm a big fan of uh, Jack, uh, you know, well, originally Jack and Daxter, but seeing that uh, Naughty Dog pushed his way away from making kitty, you know, kitty looking games like that, or uh, I guess like uh, cartoony games like that, 
uh, was something they wanted to get away from and they wanted to do something more realistic. I get that. But um, especially if you have a core fan base, I don't think you should just drop the, those particular characters right away. Like those characters are like legendary. You know, uh, I miss the era of mascots. And Sly Cooper is a mascot. He was a, a Sony mascot to me. Just as well as Jack was Jack is a Sony mascot to me. I can't see him on any other console. And the same thing with uh with Jack. I, I also thought it was weird that Spiral the Dragon um was on you know was released uh, on other consoles because I was so used to Spiral being with Sony and seeing Spiral on other consoles was just really weird to me. Um so yeah, my heart goes out to you um to Sly Cooper fans. Um hey, personally, why not why not make Sly Cooper um uh, animation uh, I, th I think that would be nice beside a movie like why don't you just make that an animated series and the same thing with jack and ratchet like i think uh some of these these game crop properties should be turned into like animations um uh, you don't really necessarily have to do a movie but um but seeing that you know uh with the success of son of the hedgehog um uh movie uh, you can do it. It's possible. If you got the right directors and the right uh, right script writers, you can make a good game in, you know, a game movie. Um, if you can't push it out like uh, in an animation type of way and if you want to do it in a game way, that's fine. But uh, I, th I don't know. I, th I think Sly could be a nice animation. And also, it will draw people to uh, want to know more about the character but also get access to the games as well. But anyway, guys, that about does it. Don't forget the bell button and subscribe button to get the notifications to my channel. And uh, stay tuned for some more uh, uh, gaming news, guys. Peace.